All right, I'm moving. I have it mounted in here and I don't like that. So I'm gonna move it and put it right here just so it's a little bit handier. In case I do wanna work my remote, sometimes I do like plowing where I'm holding it in my hand um, or I'm just standing outside, but I don't want my glove box sitting open because I don't have doors and I don't want doors and rain will get in if it's raining and stuff like that. And so I have my winch rocker switch up here. Um, but I'm moving. I had ordered an extra unit and that's why I have two thinking I needed to order one, but one came with my winch. But this one has the wiring connectivity for a rocker switch that lights up. So today I'm going to be moving this guy to here and swapping out the rocker switch and all I did is I took this sticker is kind of a pain there's a clear coating on it and don't don't peel that clear coating off because it comes off way easier by just getting the edge up with the razor blade and maybe and I sliced strips and it just peeled off in strips but it, I fiddled with it for like 20 minutes before I figured that out and I had already peeled off some of that clear coating. And then that part just took forever of just trying to lift, 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 lift with this thing. And it was just a pain. Good sticker. Um, and then I drilled the hole with this drill bit um, here. And just like I did in the glove box. And now I'm going to slide all of the unit through until I get it wedged in there. And then I'll take a drill and drill out the two holes here. And then I'll I'll uh, just bolt it in there. And there is a there's a frame piece of frame right here that let me go out. We got a lot of snow here in Wyoming. Middle of winter, but it's a warm 30 degree day. I thought so. I thought I'd come out here and work on this guy. So you can see um, where's it at? Oh, there it is. So there's the hole I just drilled. And I lined it up with this these t this framing right here so I can shoot that piece out right between it and not get in the way of the uh, um, four-wheel drive and the gear shift mechanisms which are on either side and then I'll just run my wiring right out here and I'm gonna take the other one out of the glove box and I'll just take a piece of plastic and glue it in there to cover that hole no big deal but as as I add more and more things to this I'll probably be fiddling with it and so i thought i'd even though this isn't that big of a deal i thought i'd add another video and just keep piling them up here so let me work on another step and then i'll film some more all right got that guy in looks good i like it there it's more handy to me i don't have to keep my glove box open using that remote and I wired this guy up, so it's all coming up through the frame right there, just perfectly. Keep the wire safe, see if it's right there. I guess I don't need it on. Let's see if that's lit up. Yep, lit up. Perfect. So I've got the light in there, and then... Okay, all right, now put it all back together. All right. Just pop those rivets back in. Now I have a, a lighted rocker switch. Can't really see it because of the glare of the sun, but it's lit up. So that'll be nice. And I'll just put lighted rocker switches across there as I add components. And I like having that right there better. So. Anyway, <clears throat> simple change. Probably don't need a video for it, but I like it better. <laughs> 